Yeah, so we're having a little painting party today because uh, next weekend I'm having a having a party here in the kitchen looks crazy so we're trying to get this wall. So the plaster, you know, it needs another coat and some more sanding but I can't even see what's going on without a layer of paint so I'm trying to get it white. Yeah, rah, it's a lot of work. But there's, you know, it's, this is white, the ceiling over here, we're white, it's coming together. All right, third coat of plaster on the nightmare wall, and it's getting close. It'll need one more, though. Got it painted out. It's looking a little more like a kitchen now. I popped in this cabinet just for a dry fit to make sure that I positioned the, uh, the power outlet properly. Everything seems to be working. Power's on. Check this. Whoa! Oh yeah! So I still got to build the drawers for this thing, and then there's going to be a butcher block countertop on this, and then we're knocking out these tiles over here. I'm going to do a butcher block on that as well. The subway tiles that are above the, uh, the stove are going to be right above this as well, so they'll be kind of sympathetic to each other. And then over on the wall, with a sink here, I've got this uh, light fixture. This thing's going to get replaced, and then this is going to get replaced. And then. Uh, Speaking of the sink area, this is going to be replaced with a butcher block countertop, all these tiles, and then the sink is going to be replaced with, with this awesome uh, farm sink. Big porcelain farm sink. Yeah. Hey, uh, you guys want to do some beekeeping? Because there's some, uh, there's some bees right there that, that need some keeping. It's a little bit of smoke. Man, this hive is kind of jamming now. I mean, it's just, there's a lot of bees in here. It was just three frames of brood, basically. So that, that's just a bunch of babies, but they haven't been born yet. And, uh, and then one queen, and then a, a few tired ass bees that I threw in here. This thing is, uh, man, it's really feeling alive now. I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy, because it was pretty bleak about three or four weeks ago. So that right there is a, uh, is a frame of uh, uncapped honey. What we have here is a combination of capped and uncapped uh, brood, or babies. So you can see the little larva in there, and after nine days it gets capped. The brood is in the middle, but on the edges and on the tops here, that's where they, that's where they keep the honey, on the lower frames. There's the babies. There's some super solid brood pattern here. Basically, they're just they're filling in all of the little, the little uh, hexagons with babies. I'm seeing a lot of pollen collection, which is their protein. The honey is their carb. They put it together and make something called bee bread, so it's looking good in here. There's just not a lot blooming around here, so I'm having to feed them. So this is half uh, sugar and half water. And that gets poured right into this little feeder frame here, and they can run in there. There's these little ladders in that they crawl around, and then they can go and get some food. And that's it. I'm not seeing any pests in here, no mites, no ants, nothing like that. I had three frames before, now I've got six, so things are going good. The little water source was getting a lot of crap in it, a lot of leaves and stuff, so I, I moved it away from the, the tree. 